What's going on guys, it's SSJ Dovigan here with the review of episode 34. Alright, so before I get into this episode, I just want to say thank you all for liking my videos and subscribing. We just hit that 500 mark, so we got that parody coming along pretty damn soon. And by the way, it's still in the works. It's a lot of work. Anywho, so last episode on episode 33, we ended off where Goku lost the good guy Frost. And this episode, boy oh boy, what a twist. So our episode starts off where Goku, after defeat, Chi Chi jumps into the ring, dashes, does some parkour stuff and checks if Goku's okay. Goku's alright, he flies on Chi Chi and then, you know, then we start to watch the second fight. So then we see good guy Frost go against, you know, our favorite character over here at SSJ Dovican Piccolo. Our favorite father figure, our favorite good guy character. So it's good guy Frost versus good guy Piccolo. And then it starts off as a really good fight. The animation's like a bit stale, but eh, what can you expect? You know, Super's been really lazy with the animation, but hey, still getting way better than, you know, the beginning. So then starting off, Piccolo starts off. Charging up that special beam kick! And then, you know, he's zipping around the ring. He's dodging all of Frost's movements. He's dodging all of Frost, you know, Fist of the North Star tactics. Trying to hit Piccolo's joints. It's not working out. So then, you know, Frost shoots Piccolo through the leg. Piccolo... My leg! He takes it to the leg. Then he starts, you know, making Shadow Clone Jutsus of himself. He's Shadow Clone Jutsuing himself around the ring. But then Frost is like, oh no, what am I supposed to do? So he starts blasting all the Shadow Clones, getting rid of them. But then he lets out a Soul Sonic Force. Pew, pew. Blast all the extra Piccolos out of the ring. And then he goes in, and then he hits Piccolo. Knocking out the special in that special beam cannon. Piccolo then gets hit back and then stretches out his arm and tricks Frost as he catches him off guard. And then, mind blown, Piccolo still has the special in his special beam. He's charged off that special beam. Frost doesn't know what to do. So then Frost, he's talking to Piccolo like, oh my, it looks like you have me defeated. Then out of nowhere, he flicks his wrist out and flicks Piccolo. Piccolo doesn't know what to do. He's dazed. Oh my god, no! Can this be? So then Frost goes in and shoots Piccolo inside the stomach, thus rendering him useless. Actually, he fucking blasts a hole through Piccolo, which should be illegal, by the way. I mean, how the hell did that not, like, kill Piccolo? I mean, he literally just fucking blasted a hole in his damn stomach. But anywho, that's none of my business. So then, you know, Piccolo is defeated, and... My god, I must say I was like really angry at that shit. I'm like, what the fuck? This is bullshit! How'd he fucking get past two people? But then again, it's like, holy hell, that's not cool. Like Piccolo was supposed to shine this episode. So then, it goes into, you know, alright, you know, Frost wins. But then, Jacko comes in. Jacko's like, OBJECTION! I seen this shit. Then everybody's like, what? Well, nobody can fool me. I'm fucking Jacko. I'm cool as fuck. Look at these eyes. Frost is cheating. He flicked his wrist for the last time. Then he gets the judge to examine Frost. The judge examines Frost and then finds a modification. Frost is actually a dirty cheater. He didn't know the Fist of the North Star. He didn't master that shit. He's not Kinshiro. He's nothing but a dirty jaggy, a dirty cheater, hiding shotguns. So Frost is not a good guy. He's a dirty fucking cheater and a galactic pirate. That's, well, he's pretty much a Frieza, but instead like posing as a good guy so nobody opposes him. It's fucking ridiculous, man. That's fucking bullshit. That got me so mad. I thought Frost was a good guy, man. I believed in him. But in the end, he's just a dirty bag of dirt. Yeah, so they find the modification and then they give the match to Piccolo. So, you know, Piccolo gets a little bit of redemption. But guess what happens? Fucking Vegeta steps in like, No! He forfeits the match! 
I don't care. I want to beat his ass myself. So then Champa's mad. Fucking Champa wants to beat up Frost. Everybody's mad at Frost. Goku's like, oh my god, he tricked me. And like fucking Piccolo's like, alright, you know, just take it, take it away, Vegeta. I don't give a fuck. So then now like Vegeta's like gonna you know go into the next match and beat the dog shit out of fucking Frost. Which is well deserved by the way, because he fucking fooled us all. I thought he was a good guy. Hmm. So you know what guys, I wanna know your opinion on this battle. I wanna know how you feel about Frost being a dirty dirty cheater. I just wanna know how everybody feels about this. Personally, I'm just more, you know, upset about the fact that Piccolo's just used as a grunt again. I mean, really, man. Piccolo, like, he gets his fucking time to shine and then boom. It's just ended. We're not going to see Piccolo in another fight. And actually, like, it was, like he used that technique in both matches. I don't see how, like, fucking Goku and Vegeta, you know, like, it's just fucked up, man. It's just really fucked up. Like, they should at least get a chance of redemption Piccolo and Goku. You know, for fucking Frost's cheap tactics. Mm. Oh yeah, and before I wrap this up, oh my god, that next episode looks hype! We see a hit come in, and then do some shit where he fuck- It looks like he scares the fuck out of Frost. And boy, I can't wait because we haven't seen anything from Hit. So if you guys have any speculation on the next episode either, yo, drop that comment below and just tell me what you think it is going to be like. Well, anyways, guys, thank you for watching. And as always, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want more content. And definitely look forward to that episode next week. I'm looking forward to it too. And as always, my Saiyans, my Namekians, my Earthlings. It's SSJ Tozukin, signing out.